So this is definitely not the time to give up. Um, I was just thinking about, you know, what, what, what can I say or what can I talk about uh, to bring back some positive of all these negative things happening right now. And I realized you, in any situation, you just got to take some step back and try to figure it out, you know, what's the next move. But giving up is not the option, especially if you're passionate about this entre entrepreneurship and, and, and what you're doing. Now, the question is, what can you do, you know, moving forward? So this is a time of self-motivation. You got to dig deep, deep inside you and figure out, okay, what, what, what I need to do to move forward. And for those who cannot, you know, continue and it has to stop, it's okay also, man. Stop wondering or, or focusing on what people are going to think. They're going to think about you regardless of the situation you're in also. And I was thinking about it, you know, in all my 20 years, I started over a dozen businesses and 90% of those businesses failed. And in the early days, I used to worry so much what people were going to think about me uh, as a failure, as not being able to achieve anything. As I got older now, it doesn't matter because I'm not doing business for others. I'm doing business for me. So what you can do, you can pause your business. I've done it before where, you know, things are not working out and I, I, I pause the business for, for a few months. Uh, the thing you got to realize is now with this economic downturn, finding a job or trying to hustle on the side is going to be extremely difficult. So you might as well keep going and fighting. But for those who are thinking about starting a business um, and thinking this is not the right time, I totally, totally disagree. This is actually the perfect time to start a business because a lot of the services out there are cheaper, manpower are cheaper, factory manufacturing are very cheap because they're looking for business. So everything is going to be on the cheap side. Rent, now you're going to have a better chance to negotiate because there's going to be a lot of negative impact for existing business. So, and if you look at history, a lot of successful business start out of downtime. So you need to factor that in and not think about, oh, it has to be a great time for me to start a business. First of all, there's no such thing as a great time. So I hope that gives you guys a lot of energy to keep going. Even for me, I can tell you it's rough. Uh, but hey, you know, that's just how life is. You just got to be able to figure things out and keep on going.